rotate. Was it defined? Here we're running in towards the show from the holding pattern. So we've been holding for about uh, three or four minutes out away from the show. Once we're cleared in, uh, then I come in here, descending down to about 600 feet, and we're in configuration three, so the flaps at setting three, and about 600 feet. The speed at this stage is about 150 knots, so it's a typical approach configuration for the airplane. As I come past the crowd, I'm turning away I'm starting to climb, and as I roll out of the turn there, we're selecting the landing gear up. So the landing gear doors open, the landing gear starts to retract, and I'm now climbing up to around 1,500 feet, ready to turn back in towards the, uh, the display center. The landing gear is up, uh, and we stay in the configuration three, so that's the flaps at setting three. Speed at the top there is actually quite slow, probably down around 140 knots, and then I accelerate slightly as we come back down. And I'm not using very much bank, about probably about 30 or 40 degrees angular bank in that turn. And at this stage, I'm now looking out of the window to see where the display line is to make sure that I line up properly on the display line. So descending back down to 600 feet again, and the idea is to now start the next maneuver, which is a 360 degree turn, a complete circle, flown in front of the crowd. And climbing as we're going away from the crowd, so starting at about 600 feet, climbing up to around 1500 feet at the far side of the, the turn. Again, using about 40 degrees angular bank. One of the factors in the display flying is to allow for the wind, and on this day the wind was actually blowing us slightly towards the crowd, so I was having to slacken off the turn a little bit as we go away from the crowd to make sure that I've got enough space to, to complete the turn without crossing the display line as we come back in. Now descending back down to around 600 feet, to pass in front of the crowd again at 600 feet. and again at around 150 knots. The next maneuver is going to be the low speed pass. So again, I have to roll out and uh, just fly away from the crowd a little bit to give myself room to turn back. This case, I'm not climbing quite so much, so only going up to just above a thousand feet and keeping the speed fairly slow so that I don't have to lose too much speed as I roll out for the slow speed pass. So as I come onto the display line now, I'm starting to ease the height back down towards 600 feet again. And as I roll out, throttling right the way back to allow the airplane to decelerate down to around 100, and, between 120, 125 knots. So it's a little bit slower than the normal landing speed of the airplane, but uh, still just above the speeds where the flight control laws protect uh, the air airplane from the stall. So flying past around 600 feet and about 125 knots. A very low power setting at this stage. And then as I come past the center of the display, turning away again to climb back up. And this time we're going to accelerate. The Singapore Air Show is unusual in that the display is done out over the water, over the coast. So unlike most other displays, the takeoff and landing are not part of the display itself. The crowd cannot see that. Uh, so unlike the other displays which finish with the landing, in this case we're going to finish the display with a high speed pass at around uh, 260, 270 knots. 
In order to be able to do that, though, I've got to go quite a long way away just to give myself room to turn at the higher speeds to come back uh, past the crowd at the higher speed. So we're also now changing the configuration. Everything so far has been done in configuration three, the flaps at three. Now we're raising the flaps gradually up to flap one, using that configuration to allow me to turn back. And as soon as I'm lined up with the display line again, we raise the flaps completely so that the airplane is in its clean cruising configuration. And that allows it to accelerate up to about 270 knots as we come past the crowd for the last time. Flying past around 270 knots and then pulling up using about 2G and turning. And the aim now is just to do a climbing 180 degree turn. And in the climb going right up to about 5,000 feet. Which uh, today with the cloud there is just, uh, just above the cloud in some places. So rolling out just in front of the crowd and climbing up into the cloud up to about 5,000 feet. And that's basically the end of the display there. Uh, all we do now is uh, a handover to air traffic control again to turn downwind uh, just over the main Changi airport to come back and land on the runway 02 right at the Changi East uh, airbase for the flight display. Retard. Five.